Hi everyone. I wanted to connect with you for just a few minutes this afternoon and remind you that at Foundry, we are continuing to make preparations to share worship tomorrow morning at 1115 online. Hope you're planning to join us for that. And wanted to also encourage you to connect a little bit early, beginning at 1045, we'll have a video available that the staff is putting together with information about how we are staying connected through the week, how we're practicing healthy and responsible ways of connecting in worship and in community during these days. I hope you will, uh, will avail yourselves of that. Our staff, as they've been making their preparations and doing this work today, have developed something that I've been told they call the Foundry Twirl. I'm sure we'll learn more about that in the coming days as well. Friends, these are really extraordinary moments that we're living in and opportunities for us to draw deeply on the wellspring of our faith, to let the promises of God's presence and grace and love encourage us and keep us, and also for that faith and for God's love to spill out into acts of care and concern for others. Do be thinking about the folks that may need a, a phone call or an outreach from you in these moments, these really extraordinary days that we're living together. Think about how you can be a good neighbor uh, for the folks around you. Think about the folks in your Pew neighborhood at Foundry or, or others that may need an extra word of care and encouragement. I myself am working from home today. Here I am on my sofa. There's my computer. I've been working on my sermon and I look forward to sharing it with you tomorrow and hope that as you're at home, perhaps more than you're used to, that you're taking good care of yourself and remembering that even though you may be in a place where others are not physically present, you are not alone. We are in this together and thanks be to God, God is with us. So be encouraged. I hope to connect with you online tomorrow. Be thou my